Cool, so now I have the, the bundling wrap blueprint that I already used. Um, we need, unfortunately, some more honeycomb. Because we need to get the wax paper. Wax paper, you need beeswax. Beeswax, you need honeycomb. That's going to be a little bit tricky. I think... <laughs> I wonder if I could take those guys to... Reign of Giants. You know what? That's actually not a bad idea. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going to take them. Because I remember I had hounds coming there. So now is the perfect time. If they can actually come with me, they could help me out with that. But then I don't know what would happen if they were to lose their... <laughs> their protection, the contract was to expire. They just stay there forever because then they wouldn't follow me back. Nope, they did not want to come. All right, well, I should fight these hounds anyway, really, because I'm I'm semi I'm pretty prepared right now. Oh, whoa. See, in Shipwrecked, I was thinking about this. Those eye plants would be able to take care of the hounds. No problem. In Reign of Giants? We'll see. Because they, the hounds don't get stun locked like they do in Shipwrecked. Oh, they seem to do a pretty damn good job. Yeah. Okay. Because I was going to say, like, one of these would protect you against a whole wave of crocodogs. And, yeah, it seemed to do fine. But I want the meat. Okay. I'll replant it, though, because that's, that's awesome. Great protection there. Uh, I don't have my umbrella anyway. But if we want beeswax we have to destroy some more beehives and they're like where were even the killer bees are there killer bees around here at all what is this it must be somewhere that i haven't been there's one there and one two three four that should be enough right Someone was saying if you set it on fire and then um, then put it out with ice or something, then all the bees come out, which is good, but I, I should have brought an ice staff, I guess. We'll just come over here. Hey, come on! <laughs> okay. Jesus! That's bullshit. Luckily, it, it doesn't seem to burn. <laughs> wow. That's two. Let's go to this far one. Then they can disperse a bit. It's a full moon. Alright. And... Why is this... Show that there's a... Yeah, there we go. It's gone. Alright. So we've got four. Four of those. Um, there probably is more, but that should be enough. That gives us an extra 16 slots. Well, minus the four, I guess, for actually holding them would be 12 slots. So that's pretty damn helpful. Uh, that's not the right way. So what I'll do 
Um, we need the turf. I want to collect that. So I might make a few bundling wraps. Maybe I'll make two for now. Yeah, okay. How you going, Chester? Alright, yeah, they're not interested anymore. We'll see you later then. Thanks for the help, though. They were actually a good help. I don't know if I would have been able to do it without them. They actually did a fair bit of the fighting, too. Of the actual queen. Which I didn't think they would do. I thought they would just focus on... The, the egg dudes, which I would have preferred, but that's okay. Uh, ooh. Everything is going a little bit spoiled in here. Maybe we'd make some eggs. Dude, you had to come here when I'm cooking, don't you? And what about in here? Those I don't really care about. I mean, we have honey now. Get some more health. I think now that those guys have gone ah much better hounds teeth good we needed a few more of those so we can actually make some um, sewing kits we can collect those oh yeah I forgot we have bees here too shit <laughs> they produced a fair bit <laughs> Okay, look at that, 18. Oh, we don't have enough room. <laughs> wow. Make some more eggs. All right, I gotta get these berries because those are gonna spoil. We might get some, we probably will get some turkeys. I mean, look how many we have now. It's like 30 berry bushes or something. And I need to put the door here instead of back there, because I think that makes more sense. Yes, take the bait. And I guess I can now put different turf here. Maybe go for like forest or grass turf. Yes. That's six drumsticks. Seven. Any more? Seven drumsticks. That'll have to do. Close that. Ah! Oh. No! Well, eight drumsticks, not seven. <laughs> What, did I say seven? Look at that. Oh, man. Okay. Yeah, I might wrap it up. That's pretty damn good food. And same with the coffee. You can make coffee and wrap it up. That'd be so awesome. I'll just spend like a day cooking or something. Make all the food. And then when I'm done, I can wrap it. So, I think I'll do two. I'll keep some just in case. Okay. So, beeswax. And then that's going to become wax paper. So, we'll wrap that up. Oh, yeah. So you have to refine three different recipes. Bonding wrap and a rope. Four different things. But you only have to do that once. Then you just make the rope. Okay. Cool. I hope that doesn't, that doesn't fly away. I doubt it would. Cool. So I guess honey ham is the ultimate food, isn't it? Uh, 
So those are my turkey dinners. Could I make honey ham? I don't know if you can make it with drumsticks. Does that make it? It does, okay. Yeah, so honey ham is, it's really good for health as well. So that will be the one that we get, I guess. Although you can't make that with only monster meat. If I was to do that, you get the nuggets, which are not bad, but they're not as good as the honey ham. So this food, I think, will hold. I have plenty of grass, so it's not really an, an issue making the rope for that. I like it. It's good. So honey ham is good for food and health. Um, so is surf and turf, actually. <laughs> uh, I might just have like a bundle wrap of, you know, honey ham, one of surf and turf, one of turkey dinner, one of, what else do I, can I make? Um, sanity. What's good for sanity? Surf and turf is not bad for sanity, actually. I might just put that in the other one. There's no point wasting two of them just for... All that stuff. <laughs> so make another rope. Make a bundle. Uh, yeah, we'll put half of them in there. Cause I will. I'll use some of them just to eat. Now it's a bigger bundle. Yay! Okay, how much does it give you again? Oh! Ah! Oh no! Humid season. That's not good. <laughs> Humid season, fun season. I think now is the perfect time to head over to Rain of Giants. <laughs> um, I'll take a bundle. I'll take a pitchfork as well, and we'll just get a bunch of turf. I probably won't even need the bundle actually. I have plenty of space. Did I fertilize the coffee beans? I didn't. I should probably do that. Just take that last one. Do that before I go, so then they're ready when I come back. So the turf that I want, I want to get some cobblestone, obviously. That's probably the most important one. I also want to get a little bit of... Maybe a stack of forest. I don't know, just to sample it. I don't know. Forest and whatever other green grass there is. It's just grass turf. Also... I think, it, is it 14 days until Apocalypse? So I gotta keep that in the back of my mind. I don't wanna forget about that, no way. Okay, got the, oh yeah, we need to fertilize it. Hmm, take those. Not that. I have a lot of grass. <laughs> a lot of wood, I could just burn that. I probably have some ash as well. That should be plenty though. All right, let's head to Rain of Giants. I can get some turf from Shipwrecked as well, but I think that will come in due time. Don't really need it just yet. I wonder, oh, should I make a drying rack area? Because jerky, it's not as good with wag stuff, but it's still good enough. And it would save me from losing a lot of meat to wastage, things like that. So it could be beneficial. We'll take, we'll take Chester as well. So then we can grab like a shitload. So first stop, there should be some around here. So we'll just go this way. Boing, 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 boing. 
Hello, Mr. B. Sorry about... Oh. Oh, shit. They're all here. The whole squad is here. Okay. Well, I will have to kill you. If it comes to that, if it's either you or Chester, I'm going to pick you. Alright, so now we're on Cobblestone Watch. I also kind of like this turf. This is nice turf. Might take a bit of that too. Oh, come on. Leave him be. What did he do to deserve it? Here we go. So I reckon two stacks of this turf and I'll take as much cobblestone as I could possibly carry because that stuff is like gold. You can hold the rock too. <laughs> uh, you can... I'll keep that on me. Just got to be careful that there are no mole worms or anything like that to come and eat all this turf. I don't know why they eat turf. They eat rocks, all kinds of rocks, which is fine. I understand that. But turf? Strange. Don't, no. Don't spread it, Chester. Luckily, it's only the, the rocky turf. I swear, every time I decide to um, dig up the turf first instead of picking it up straight away, something bad always happens. <laughs> Either someone comes and eats it or it gets struck by lightning or it blows away or just something bad happens. Always! Back off. Leave me alone. Da, 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 da. Stop it. Curse this season. Wait, how many did I get of this? Rocky. Alright, uh, we'll get one more stack. So I need nine. You never know, Rocky might be the one that I use instead of Cobblestone, because it's a little bit more lenient. I don't know. Cobblestone goes underneath everything though, so it's really useful like that. Cool. My umbrella. Now I've got all these bees everywhere. Is that rocky or is that mud? It's uh, swampy. Oh, hello. Oh, come on. Alright, more for you to hold, Chester. Hmm, that seems to be about it. Oh, there's a little bit here. Thank you. There was another area of cobblestone as well. I don't want to hurt you. But I will if you approach me again. All right, good stuff. And that's all she wrote, I think. Unless, oh, there could be more here. Let's check that out. Let's check it out. Oh, another sinkhole. That must be the third one. 
bin hier. Come on. Give me the good stuff. Oh boy, okay, that's that <laughs> that's not exactly what I had in mind. <laughs> Shit. That's a tall fort right there. No, leave him be. I don't really want to have to fight them all because there are so many of them. Although, I don't think they fight together, do they? They don't help each other. And there's no, there's not even any cobblestone around here, so there's not much point. That's crazy, though. Ooh. There was Glomer there. Yeah, there's nothing even in there. Oh, Chester, he just goes right through. <laughs> just heedless, that guy. Absolutely heedless. What a mad lad. So this was the only area. What? Doesn't look like there's more there. Oh, what a shame. Really? Wow, this is actually a pretty shit Reign of Giants world. Not many bees, not much cobblestone. Uh, it's got a big hole in the middle. Alright, um, I said I wanted some grass, so we'll get a little bit of grass, maybe I'll get some of this, what is this, grass turf, yeah I thought it was, what the fuck do you want? So get some grass turf. Get some forest turf as well, and then we'll see which one looks nicer. What the fuck? I didn't even come near you. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Well, that's the end of that, I think. We could probably go back now. Where's my... My way home? It's here. Let's go. All the way around, okay. I didn't even need the bundling wrap. I mean, I probably could get more, but there wasn't as much cobblestone as I would have thought. I normally can find like, you know, four, five, six stacks of it. Could hardly find anything. Was that Moose Goose? I don't know. It probably was. Oh! <laughs> okay. So... <sighs> well, you made it through. Take the cobblestone. Um, I might have to bundle something in the end. <laughs> there you go. Thank you, Chester. I'll see you next time. i got to stop saying that because people think that I end the episode. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. I'm going to have to leave it there for today. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Leave a like if you did. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care.